Good afternoon. Yeah, My good name afternoon is Kanika to... and I'm for today. Okay, nice okay, to meet you, Kanika. So, uh, me nice to meet you too. Um, Megha, I did not receive my session content. There was some okay. error. Okay. All right. So, did you receive the content? Did you receive the material? Uh, yeah, I received. Uh, it is about uh, in in uh, financial planning. Okay, financial planning. So Regarding, let's just but, talk about that, I guess. Yeah, we can do. But if you if you want to change topics, so I will be okay with that also. No, it's all right. Let's just talk about financial planning. It's okay. 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 So, yeah. Okay. So can you um, explain me? What do you understand by this term? Okay. Financial planning. So financial planning is a planning that we we plan about our financial condition or financial goals that where we are currently and what we want to achieve in future and according to the, all these things we should we have to plan yeah that where, yeah, where that we are. Is, yeah. yes yeah okay financial plan is in, planning is obviously uh, plotting your plans how can you uh, save money and where to spend the money where to invest how to you know um, all together make use of it so have you ever used this in your life have you ever tried to plan or have you ever done financial planning in your life like I need to save this much this month, something like that. Yes, I uh, did that uh, because uh, I I I started my job uh, very early earlier in my uh, age. So initially, I at an got, early age. Yes. Sorry, what did you say? I said at an early age when you say. I and started doing jobs at an early, early age. Yeah, that's how you say it. Okay. So, yeah. So, at that time, I didn't know about these things. But uh, after some time, I came to know that financial planning is very important in your life, especially if you have a job. So, you should be, you should be able to plan your, uh, what you want to do in your life. But, and obviously, for that, you should have a good uh, financial planning right so I started uh, doing that but uh, not um, not in a good way I can say like that why because I didn't know exactly how to do that okay 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 <laughs> okay so yeah then I uh, realized that and I searched some videos and something and uh, then I came to know that these are the things I should I should have done at that time and I, I started doing this okay so yeah so I believe that uh, say uh, if you have the money so you should have you should uh, do both things you should invest your money in something and save it as well yes yes obviously so can you give some tips <laughs> <laughs> Okay. where did you invest was it beneficial for you and something like that uh it's i cannot suggest someone but some there are some things that uh, everybody can do like uh, uh if you want to save your money so fd is there to apply and that is the sub easiest way to save your money yeah. but as you know there is no such interest amount nowadays we we get very less amount of interest so there is no sense according to me to put your money in fd instead of that you can save your money in your saving accounts yeah saving account yes yes so yeah uh, apart from that uh, ppf and um, some bonds are there if you really okay. want to save your money apart from the 
banking things and everything related to bank and drafts some other tips related to saving money all right so saving money okay you can uh, spend your money in gold in um, uh, silver silver you mean buying jewelry and then waiting for the price to increase so that yeah. you can sell <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that is a very good thing you know it's uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah but if you really want to save your money so instead of buying jewelry you should buy some biscuits and all that you know, kind of things i am not interested in at all in gold buying in gold i don't I yeah so and uh, um uh, uh additionally I want to say that if you are interested in share market so you can uh, invest your money yeah that's there as well yeah but yeah for, for that you, you know you have that experience. you have a knowledge of this field you cannot yeah. go without any knowledge so in, instead of making money you will losing your money here there's a lot of risk in share markets yeah but do uh, just suggest me what uh, what you are uh, trying to ask me that apart from uh, banks and all these things where we can put my money and save my money where you can save as in um, let's say well you already gave an example of saving money like investing in jewelry or buying something that you can later on sell at a good price yes that is a good idea of you know investing and saving both and indirectly so, way i i want to add one more thing yeah yeah uh, sure. directly you cannot save uh, money in this way but mm -hmm. if you are investing your money to learn some skills in your life so it 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 will be asset for you and it yeah. will be it will make lots of money for you it would make in money future. for you in future yeah invest in yes. skills that's right yes. like you are doing right now yes yes my yeah, you can <laughs> you are obviously investing in the right place and this is definitely going to help you when you go out pitch at different companies you know definitely it's a great thing you know uh yes because what hap uh, sorry what happens uh generally we have a mindset that uh, we are not that intended to put our money to learn something we we feel that it is a waste of money and waste mm -hmm. of time uh but if you are really um uh, uh i can say um full of mind i didn't get proper word full of mind okay so you are able to think in a long perspective sorry full of mind as in motivated confident or thinking about future in hindi i i i explain you means agar aapka thoda bhi dimag hai aapke paas if you are agar aapka dimag sahi se kaam karta hai to you can agar aap smart as in if you are smart enough to actually you know uh, invest that money in the correct place and make sure to use that with future references yes. then it's good that is what you are doing right now yeah okay you don't <laughs> say full of money either say clever smart or intelligent yes. yeah yeah if you are smart enough or you are a clever so you come to know that uh, spending money in learning something new will is be is not a way yeah will be a big asset for you in your future yes. life yes yes absolutely okay so let me give you a situation okay what would you do if you failed to achieve your financial planning for example you made a budget plan you made a list of where to invest where to save what to do what if you fail to achieve that how would you you know help yourself out of it how would you feel what are the next steps you are going to take okay if if i failed so i first thing i will do that i just uh um i start let me think start again no no i start saving money in those 
things which I spend to uh, entertain myself, to to entertain myself or to give luxurious feeling to myself. Shopping or watching Netflix. Yes, mm-hmm. yes, yes. I, 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 I'm going to stop these things and I'll start saving my money. And uh, yeah, and if I, I would be able to do some part of part time job. If I really need money, so I will prefer that to do, to save my money and to fulfill my financial goals or plan. That's great. That's great. Yes. Okay, so um, I think the class might end in some time. I am not sure, but let's just keep on talking until unless it doesn't yes, end. Okay. Okay. So um, do you have any questions for me regarding this or regarding anything else? You know. Okay. Uh, let me can think. Me, can you tell me why do you want to learn spoken English? Yeah, I I would like to tell you. Uh. There are lots of reasons, but firstly, that I just want to be a very fluent speaker. Okay. okay. Yeah, I I am passionate about that. Oh, great. This is this is my interest. You can say, or this is my desire to be like that. Means okay. in future, I want to look like a good uh, speaker with accuracy. Okay. That's I, I I have a good communication skill. I can talk almost every subject yeah i can see that you're really good at communicating and yes and secondly i i want to make it career as well my, my career as well okay so you want to make a career in english yeah. yes yes i Maybe want to examples? sorry example like teaching uh, english yes. something like that yeah teaching english i i am doing this currently as well i am i am i have my channel english with megha so i am doing <laughs> currently as well i am learning as well and i am teaching as well so That's both things i am doing and i will uh, i look forward to um, give exam ielts exam ielts yeah okay yeah so yeah so many things i want to do i just want to be very good in adding in english or at english i don't know at english <laughs> yeah you, uh, you want to be good at speaking english at speaking english yes okay yeah you're really good at it i mean obviously your pronunciation just requires a little practice you form proper sentences and there's just a slight lack of words like full of brain instead of clever and smart and yes. you know just try to learn new words every day try to uh, you know practice it with yourself try to read books or but don't you think so that i i learned uh, i already learned so many vocabularies because i i was yes. i'm doing youtube and i'm i am making con- content but i am failed to use at the time of speaking i, I you are not able to use the correct words while you speak yes. it's a confidence issue it usually happens more like uh, when we give exams we don't remember the answers we remember when we go home we sit and like oh i should have written this i know i know <laughs> that is uh, yeah i think it will it will be it will get get rid of in future by practicing i can say like that yes sometimes i doubt myself and, yeah that is a self confidence issue as i said obviously when you're not confident enough or when you feel the person in front of you might judge you you get nervous and you make silly mistakes you make mistakes in the things you are very much aware of yes. the ones you do very well you still make mistakes so you just need to you know nobody is perfect everybody is you know learning we are practicing i am talking to you i am practicing english as well i am speaking i am making myself better okay all you have to do is practice and be confident with what you know and just you know take a deep breath while you speak in front of public or with someone else take a deep breath speak slowly understand what you have to say and then go on okay and you can you know record yourself you yes. can read books you can watch english movies 
you know with subtitles <laughs> i'm doing all these things nowadays <laughs> yeah great. but yeah sometimes i i i irritated to myself that i'm doing same mistake again and again what happens what happens with me well you know you should um, if you make the same mistakes and you know you're aware of your mistakes and areas of improvement you can you know write them down okay you can uh, write them down for example the words you don't remember okay. you write the word you remember and then you search it up or look it up or maybe ask ask someone and write the correct meaning the correct word you okay. write down you make notes okay you try to practice those notes and slowly you will improve okay okay my nice slowly i will improve you 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 can give me guarantee that slowly i will improve <laughs> You definitely are very much good at it. I think it, it, this is very silly okay. question I'm asking you. Sorry for that. No, obviously you will. I can guarantee that you're already so good at communicating. I, 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 I was not so. Um, I was really shocked. I was. I never thought. You know, I could teach someone like this. You're absolutely good at speaking. You're good at communicating. Just some lack of words and a little pronunciation error, and rest is absolutely all right. Okay. Okay. Thank you. I will. I will. You will get better with time. Maybe better than me. Maybe better than rest of us. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> I, I'll. I'll. I'm. I'll work on this. Yeah. And I. 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 I am telling in front of you that I don't know. I should tell. I should tell you or not that I keep promising myself that I will do that in future. Yeah. Definitely. Okay. But just in case you forget, write it down. That's yes. the best thing. Make notes. That is okay. what I do when I forget something, and it has helped me a lot. I make sticky notes. I write it down, and then I practice it again and again. Because sometimes things slip out of your mind, even yes. if you're aware of them. You know. Yes, yes, yeah. It happens. It happens a lot of time with me. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, so yeah. And- Try to relax yourself and don't worry about anything. Okay, okay. It, it is very nice sitting with you, Kanika.